Hello YouTube, how are you? Today I'm going to show you how to configure DSCP in Cisco Router. So uh, first of all we have to know that what is DSCP. DSCP is Dynamic Host Configuration Protocol and, uh, why, we'll, and why we will use it. Uh, uh, if in your network uh, there are uh, if you configure DSCP, DSCP in your network then your client computer get IP address easily right uh, if there is no DSCP then uh, you have to uh, go control, pa control panel then uh, network sharing and uh, whatever uh, if I go from there then network adapter then you have to configure IP address the uh, client side manually and uh, uh, look in this PC uh, which uh, which right now I am using uh, this PC is getting IP address via DSCP right obtaining IP uh, obtaining an IP address automatically it means DSCP uh, when this computer is boot up then it sent a DSCP request to, to the server when server get this DSCP request the server provide the IP address to this to my uh, to this computer and if I show the detail then uh, I can see I can see that uh, here IP IPv4 address is uh, 1.168.0.101 and IPv4 subnet mask something uh, it, this whole information is occupied by DSCP right so today we will show you how to configure this uh, how to configure this DSCP in Cisco router so first of all here I take a router then switch you can choose any one of them there is no binding because uh, uh, this tutorial is just for practice purpose Okay. Now I am choosing the copper straight through cable, gigabit Ethernet. Uh, anyone you can choose any port from switch. There is also no binding. just uh, it finished okay uh, and here I am using 192.168.0.0 slash 24 this network okay okay I am configuring uh, now go to the Cisco router and no enable configure terminal okay uh, first of all, I have to up this uh, g uh, gigabit 0 by 0 Ethernet and have to put IP address on that e on that interface interface gigabit Ethernet 0 by 0 IP address 192.168.0.1 and mask 255.255.255.0 uh, no shutdown okay sorry okay the, my uh, this information is up okay till now if I check this client PC and there is no IP address and uh, uh, this client IP address is using a static right it's static now we will configure DSCP in Cisco router first of all exit from here and uh, first command is IP DSCP pool okay yeah, mm, first you have to create DSCP DSCP pool and put the name of this pool you can choose any name there is no binding so here I put DSCP DSCP pool name is DSCP and uh, DSCP will use which network? Okay, 
192.168.0.0 and IP address sorry mask dot zero in this case I am using 192.168.0.0 network right okay and what is the default gateway default router 192.168.0.1 okay uh, if I uh, okay I will show you later it will be uh, uh, it will be easy to make you understand okay then I am exit okay now go to the client IP address and send DHCP request to the server look this client PC get the IP address from the server and look here DNS, DNS server is empty if you want we can provide this or provide DNS server also DNS server IP address also uh, how then exit now uh, enter to the configure terminal uh, Uh, there is one important thing when you uh, when, uh, important thing uh, in your practical life when you working in a large organi or organization so you will see uh, in router there is a there have configured lots of DSCP servers and how to isolate it each DSCP server you can isolate it each DSCP server by DSCP pool name right in this case I am in this case in this router uh, there I am configured only one DSCP and uh, what is the name of the t DSCP the name of DSCP is DSCP okay so first and uh, so first I have to enter this DSCP pool IP DSCP pool DSCP now entered and if what gonna what gonna I am to here I entered I entered router CLI to show how I add DNS server IP address also right then just here Right, put this command DNS server and what is the DNS server IP address let's say in this case my DNS server IP address is 192.168.0.10 ok now again go to the client and send the DSCP request to the server again look here is the, here is the DNS server IP address this is the DSCP this is the DSCP okay thank you guys thank you for watching and uh, I will provide all of this command in the description box if uh, if you have any trouble you can collect from there and if there is any difficulties to un understand you can comment uh, I will try to response thank you thank you very much and don't forget to subscribe